It's Derby Day. The city is alive with anticipation and the stadium is packed all the way to Rose Ed. No fan would want to miss this. Which side will rise to the occasion? Well, here we go on a special day in Milan. It always is for the Derby della Madonnina. Inter against Milan. I'm Guy Mowbray alongside Sue Smith here at the San Siro. What an atmosphere, what an occasion. Yeah, in recent years, there's been a real resurgence. Both of these sides are highly competitive and I'm expecting a fast-paced game here. Could be a moment of brilliance that decides this one. I'm looking forward to it, Guy. Good defending to close down the shot. This is the Inter starting 11. Jan Sommer is in goal. Alessandro Bastoni plays alongside Stefan de Vrij in the centre of defence. Henrik Mkhitaryan starts alongside Nicolo Barella in central midfield. And they're going with two men leading the line. This is today's Milan lineup. Mike Magnan is in goal. Davide Calabria starts with Theo Hernandez as the fullbacks. Rafa Liao starts with Christian Pulisic out wide and leading the attack is Olivier Giroud. They're not getting close enough here. And that's one taken for the team. The attack stopped, but maybe at a cost. And that is very early on in the match to get a yellow card. He just didn't need to do that, did he? Means he'll have to be so careful now for the rest of the game. And somehow he's been denied. Superb work. Well, Lautaro Martinez is very much the player's player. Many have picked him out as the one they'd most like to be partnered by in attack. What should we expect from him today, Sue? Yeah, he's so efficient in front of goal. Whenever a chance comes his way, he at least tests the goalkeeper. The defence are going to have to remain focused for the full 90 minutes because he only needs one chance and he'll punish you. Promising looking attack from Inter. Morella. In the right position to cut out the pass. Oh, great block. Christian Pulisic. Good work from Inter to win back possession. What a chance here! And that is a terrific stop. Oh, his positioning is spot on. Really makes it difficult for the attacker. Stops an almost certain goal there. Jalhanolu. It's played into the box. And that's not properly away yet. Barella. And over the byline, goal kick to come. Inter have possession again. Ruben Loftus Cheek. Onto Giroud. Excellent reading of the game to win the ball. Could be something building for Inter here. Genuine chance. It's in! And it's the goal the crowd has been longing for. Just have a listen to that. If we watch this again, you can see he's under all sorts of pressure, but still manages to keep his cool and he finishes it off well. And the game restarts with the score 1-0. Come out of play, it's a throw in. Loftus cheek. Rada Krunic. 
This is looking good. Now what comes next? Well, can Milan take advantage of this set piece? The corner taken short. Put into the middle. Oh, it looked as though the header was goal-bound. That's a really good stop. And they go again with another corner. And it's a short corner. Keep going, says the referee. Advantage. Krunic. Giroud! It's there! That didn't last long. They're back level already. Well, here we can see it again, and I'm sure the keeper's a little frustrated. He does get a decent touch on it, but just not enough to keep it out. It's quite unfortunate, really. And away we go again at one all. Dumfries. Dumfries. Now, can he get the cross in? Well, any chance has gone for now. Calabria. On to Pulisic. Good, strong tackle. It'll be a throw-in. Good ball in behind. Saved by the keeper. Short corner it is. Giroud. Krunic. No need to worry about that effort for the keeper. Mkhitaryan. On to Dumfries. There's a lot of room out wide for Inter now. Cut back nicely. Mkhitaryan went for it, and it wasn't a bad try. It's been hammered just wide. Possession given away. Rafa Leao. Found nicely and in. Still a chance off the keeper. Rafa Leao. Hernandez. Oh, maybe a bit of space now. For the lead here. And that's not a bad save at all. Delivered into the box. So much room out wide for Inter. And into the box it goes. And that will do it for the first half here in Milan. Well, of all the players we're watching today, would you agree that he'd certainly get good marks so far? Well, he stepped forward for his team with the equaliser. Could prove to be a key turning point, but you do feel they'll have... Off we go. The second half underway. Hernandez. On to Kier. Krunic. On to Rafael Leao. The pass was red and the ball has changed hands. Kier. Krunic now. Nicely played. 
Oh dear, it's a miss. It's an effort he won't want to see again. Lautaro Martinez. Promising looking ball. De Marco. And that's a nice, easy catch from a disappointing ball in. Goes for goal! But well watched by the goalkeeper, and not one for the highlights. Krunic. Teo Hernandez. On to Rafael Leao. Still going here. Giroud for the lead now and it's a goal or is it that must have been close oh it's really close he's only just offside guy he needs to keep getting himself into those goal scoring positions though good interception to take the ball Fikayo Tomori Pobega Rafa Leao onto Krunic switched on and ready to intercept there there's a chance for the breakaway here can they take advantage the ball out it's going to be a throw in Nice pass, and on they march. Oh, it looked like he could have been in there. Brilliant work defensively. Oh, great work. What's next? Oh, top quality goalkeeping to deny what looked a likely goal. Here it comes, and it's cleared away off the line. That looks like a good advantage played. Well, Milan have dominated possession over these last 15 minutes or so, and they're starting to create plenty of chances too. You sense it's inevitable that the goal will come. It's certainly no less than they deserve. Able to skip past his man. Calabria. Obega. Oh, great block. Inter showing good width here. Barella. Oh, that's fabulous from the goalkeeper. Yeah, it is. What a fantastic save that is. Shows great power and agility to get to it. Certainly one for the show reel. And the ball comes in. They've got another. And he's got another. Two for the game. again and it's a good delivery in from the corner and it's intelligent movement and a strong connection to take it past the goalkeeper it's a good finish that so it's 2-1 as the game restarts Picayo Tamori. On to Kier. Calabria.
And simple for the keeper to just come and collect. Davide Fratesi. Quadrado. Well, there's the flag. Offside. Good advantage played by the ref. Fikayo Tomori. Hernandez. Not much time left. They need an end product from this. And that's a bad one. Just how bad is down to the referee? Hernandez. Krunic. And the keeper more than equal to it. Well, with time running out, can they take advantage from this corner? Played into the box. And there it is! All square in the derby. It always delivers. Joyous scenes in the away end. Well, let's take another look at this. It's a good delivery from the corner. And that's a great technique, exactly how you get taught to head the ball as a kid. It's a good finish. And we're underway again with the scores level once more. Juan Cuadrado. Fratesi. And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. That's been viewed as a foul. A free kick's awarded. There could be a chance to win the game here. Well, the fans are trying their best to push the team forward. I'm sure they feel there's a goal coming. A little wayward with the pass. And that'll be a throw-in. Not a good throw. And possession changes hands. Really good pass. The pass was red and the ball has changed hands. Fratesi. Milan being afforded too much space here. Oh, it's cleared away from goal. Superb defending. Trying to force a mistake. And it's been cut out. There's the turnover. This looks really good. Could we see a winning goal? Put into the middle. And there it is. It's full time. <laughs> 